Welcome friends at the Summary Club. Today we are going to talk about whether you should get tattoos nowadays and why. After all, many people today are asking themselves this question, should I get a tattoo? Well, I suggest that we briefly weigh up all the pros and cons of whether a person should get tattoos on his body or the desire to do on his body a long-awaited and fashionable tattoo can turn out quite undesirable consequences for the health, psyche and even fate of the person. Why do people get tattoos? Since ancient times people have decorated their bodies with tattoos. At that time, of course, it was not just for fun tattoos were applied, for example, to intimidate the enemy, to determine social status and position in society and the like. There was also an occult motivation for putting a tattoo on one's body, for it was believed that a certain mark on the body could give the wearer the power of a certain deity or spirit. Although payment for new opportunities, of course, could be unpredictable and was often limited to more than just free energy. The main thing is that such tattoos were applied only by shamans versed in it, while independent flirtation with the otherworldly world has never been welcomed throughout history. Also, various esoteric teachings have often suggested applying various signs, numbers and symbols to protect against evil spirits or people, or to give the person wearing them certain qualities of character, previously absent in it. Therefore, it is especially bad when these same signs are used today only for beauty, not even guessing what impact tattoos can play on the future fate and most importantly the character of the person. In the Middle Ages, tattoos were also used to brand criminals thieves, murderers, and rapists, of course, if they were not executed. This was done so that people could see who they might have to deal with. Well, or slaves, so that it would be obvious which master they belonged to, where they escaped from, and to whom they should be returned after capture, respectively. And in the East they were worn exclusively by geisha and girls of easy virtue, which causes and now a similar attitude towards tattooed women in many countries. But today even unconsciously wearing tattoos has somehow become a kind of fetish, well as they say stylish, fashionable, youthful. In this case, most often many people do not even think about the possible meaning of this or that picture on the skin. Of course, this is everyone's own business, and no one has the right to judge at the very least, it's indelicate. But we are practically obliged to advise you. Now there is a great number of specialized tattoo salons, with professional equipment and appropriate respect for the client. In such institutions to do tattoos is relatively safe, if of course do not count the possible allergy to the components of the paint and to the pain too. Also the price in such salons not bad bite, so many turn to self-taught with homemade machines. Here there is already a considerable amount of risk. It is absolutely safe to make a tattoo in artisanal conditions, you can get at least a skin disease, at the most blood poisoning, or even worse AIDS. Austrian dermatologists, by the way, found out that tattoo can lead even to cancer. Not too pleasant, is not it? Subscribe to the Summer Club and watch short versions of the most popular and useful videos every day. Therefore, the harm of tattoos for health here is rather unambiguous, because they certainly will not bring good health and your skin, but the health problems may well. Are tattoos moral? Public opinion in this matter should also be taken into account. Tattoos can prevent you from getting a lot of jobs, with them often, not even hired as a waiter, not to mention the more stringent businesses and organizations. And religion doesn't really approve of skin graffiti, either according to believers, our bodies do not belong to us, they belong to God. Even a hardened atheist would have to take that into account there are plenty of deeply religious people. The dangers of getting tattoos on your body psychologists and desodorists consider tattoos as something capable of changing destiny in one or another direction. Applying one image we begin to move in one direction, applying another in another, so deciding whether it is possible to do a tattoo with this or that sign is better to consult with a specialist, or better yet with two or three, and independently read about it on the internet. The tattoo is a serious matter, it can theoretically bring the owner his wealth, fame and success, and can deprive him of everything he has. For example, applying the image of the dragon on the body you risk exposing yourself to negative events, as the dragon is a rather unpredictable mythical animal, which cannot be tamed by everyone. 
Therefore, an untrained person who does not have the right character traits, some tattoos are frankly dangerous to put on your body. Another disadvantage is the aesthetic appearance of the tattoo in old age. Just imagine the sagging, flabby skin on, say, your arm, on which the outlines of the Chinese characters are vaguely visible. Sorry for the details, but often it just looks like indelible dirt stains on the skin, that is all. Also, a novice tattoo artist can make a mistake when applying a tattoo. Or, as often happens, in a couple of years tattoos that you have beaten up in your youth become irrelevant. Love can pass, musical passions and hobbies change. But the removal of quite expensive and painful procedure, after which most often remain for life scars. What kind of tattoos are there? Tattoos can be permanent, temporary those that are applied henna, they disappear in a month maximum and permanent makeup tattoo. Certain tattoos are designed for different parts of the body. They come for the back, arms, legs, chest, face, and even genitals. The most common tattoos can be called the types with pronounced distinctive features. Celtic, Oriental and Tribal. For example, the Celtic is characterized by ancient Celtic ornaments, the Oriental uses Asian themes, and the Tribal is characterized by images made of stripes of different lengths. Of course, these are by no means all types of tattoos, but it would probably take several pages to list them, and that is not really important to talk about today. The role of tattoos for men. Nowadays, the male brutal tattoo no longer plays such a symbolic role as before. Much more often men decide to get a tattoo to emphasize their brutality and believe that the attention of the female sex they will get even more. Classic male tattoos can be considered Gothic and Celtic. Images of birds of prey, dragons and wild beasts are in great demand when the image of a predator becomes an outward manifestation of his soul. It should not be forgotten that for a very long time tattoos were made only by people serving sentences, convicts. So it is worth to consult the master about the meaning of this or that symbol in order to avoid embarrassing and often even dangerous situations when you get a tattoo, which, according to the convicts, still had to earn. Tattoos for girls. Female tattoos are really a great opportunity for many girls to emphasize her natural beauty. Psychologists confirm that even a small tattoo greatly raises the self-esteem of our beautiful girls. Unlike men's tattoos, women's tattoos are often more elegant and less voluminous. Tattoos with symbolic meaning are very popular. Zodiac signs, hieroglyphs, stylized images of plants and animals. No less popular with girls or angels, kittens and stars. And where to go without flowers. In my opinion, Flowers are the best option for nice girls, because according to Vitas, flowers are also created from the energy of love, like a woman's body, so they are combined together extremely harmoniously and complement each other. No one, of course, does not prohibit a woman and make a whole sleeve tattoos, face a scary demon or stuff a huge dragon, but it would be very very extravagant and can play a negative role in her fate. Because we have already said that naturally any sign on the body, both female and male, will definitely affect the character and the way this person is perceived by other people around. Therefore, it is better to really think 10 times as they say, before making a wrong decision, which then will never change. Well, now it is time to sum it up. Of course, it is only for you to choose whether to do a tattoo on your body or not, but before doing a tattoo make sure you know what it means and think about what new it can bring to your life and whether you will regret it the next day. Well and if you decide to put a tattoo on your body and 100% really sure that to the end of life you will not change your mind about this decision, regardless of any consequences, then at least do them only at professionals. Do not save money, relying on the chance and skill self-taught, it is better to think about your health. After all, we have only one. Well, in the next publications we will talk more about the role, meaning and significance of many tattoos. And friend, don't forget to subscribe to the Summary Club for becoming more successful educated kinder and wiser every day. Save hundreds of hours and dollars spending on boring regular education. Feel free to write your opinions and questions about each video. We read all the comments.
In addition, go to our official website, where you can find reading materials or watch other videos on channel and links in the description. All the best.